Hey everyone and welcome back to Home Plates. So Memorial Day is right around the corner and we all know that that means that everyone's gonna be firing up the grills, making hot dogs, hamburgers, but I wanted to put a twist on your normal, boring, old grilled hot dog and make some bacon wrapped chili cheese dogs. Let's do it. So all you need to make these hot dogs is obviously eight hot dogs, eight strips of bacon, 10 ounces of your favorite chili, a half a cup of shredded cheddar cheese, a half a cup of shredded mozzarella cheese, and eight hot dog buns. Let's get to bacon wrapping these hot dogs. I kind of pulled the bacon as I was wrapping it around the hot dog just to make sure it stayed on there really well and the whole hot dog was covered in bacon. Since it is spring and has been raining like crazy here, I had to do my grilling inside, but these came out just as good on my George Foreman grill. I had it at 400 degrees and I cooked them for five minutes on one side, turned them and then did five minutes on the other side. So now that we have our bacon wrapped hot dogs, it's time for the chili and it's time for the cheese. So I just went ahead and put about a tablespoon of chili on top of each hot dog. And if you guys couldn't tell, I love me some cheese. So I went a little cheese crazy. And there you go, my friends, bacon wrapped chili cheese dogs, perfect for any Memorial Day party. Would you look at that? Seriously, get in on that. I am excited to try these out right now. Pick the least messy one because we all know I am quite messy. It's not my fault, I'm making messy things. I'm not usually that much of a mess, okay? Mm. I could honestly just take one bite now and tell you guys how it is, but it's like, I'm actually really hungry right now, so I'm gonna take another bite, excuse me. Those are seriously so good. If you guys make these for Memorial Day, game day, whatever kind of day, definitely take a picture and tweet me or Instagram me and use the hashtags homeplace and family because I would love to see how they turn out. And please keep those recipe suggestions coming. If you have a game day grub recipe that you've been making for years or something you've never tried before and you've just seen it floating around on Pinterest, leave me a link or a recipe or whatever down below and maybe you'll see your suggestion here on a future homeplace episode. And of course, if you like this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the family channel if you're not already. Thank you all so much for watching and I will see you guys next Wednesday for another episode of Home Plates. Bye guys. If you guys made it all the way to the end of the video and you still haven't subscribed yet, come on, what are you waiting for? Click that red subscribe button below because I promise you, you are not gonna wanna miss out on anything.